do you know what's on the PTCB exam this year? Like seriously, you're doing all that studying. Do you really know? Are you really sure? Let's see. Hey guys, it's Onisha Biggs of PharmacyTechLessons.com and today I'm going to deliver to you some information concerning what's on the 2020 PTCB exam, okay? But first, can you please show some support to the channel? Please like the video, subscribe for me if you're not already, or you can even leave us a comment. I really prefer you leave us a comment because I really do read you guys' comments and I love hearing your feedback, hearing what you need, um, and even hearing your thoughts on some of the things that we put out. So please go do that for me real quick. Now let's get into it. All right, so I'm just gonna cut straight to the chase. First thing that you need to look out for on this year's PTCB exam is the pharmacy math. I'm sure you probably heard this over and over and over and over again, but I'm just gonna tell you directly from one of the most influential sources in the space, okay? We've trained thousands of students. You need to know pharmacy math. You need to know at least basic algebra, okay? When it comes to pharmacy math. Now, another part of pharmacy math is not as difficult as people think. You just need to learn terminology, like literally pharmacy terminology, that's it. So no basic algebra, pharmacy terminology, boom, you got pharmacy math, you're gonna be A-OK -okay on the exam, all right? Here's another thing you need to know for the PTCB exam this year if you want to pass. The top 200 drugs. Yes, again, I'm pretty sure you've heard this over and over and over and over and over again, but I'm here to reiterate to you, you do need to know it. Now, contrary to popular belief, you don't only just need to know brand and generic only, okay? But let me say this, you also don't need to go study so hard that you're trying to become a pharmacist if you're just trying to pass the PTCB exam, okay? Just learn the basic brand, generic, um, even the group classifications, and some, some pharmacology dealing with like food um, and, and, and different drugs that cannot go together. Learn the basics of that, but you don't need to go like way into it. Learn some basic food, drug interactions, drug, drug, and you'll be good, okay? Don't overwhelm yourself, and please, 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 don't try to cram your head with the top 200 drugs. Okay, don't try to just memorize them just in one day, in two weeks, but I'll talk about that on another video. But yes, the top 200 drugs is something huge that you need to know for this exam. All right, also for the 2020 exam, you definitely need to know pharmacy functionality, okay? Now, what does this include, Onisha? This is talking about things like safety in the pharmacy. These are things like procedures in the pharmacy and even pharmacy law. So basically the basic rules of the operation of a pharmacy encompasses all of that stuff, okay? So you need to know everything dealing with that as it pertains to your scope of work, which would be a pharmacy technician if you're taking the PTCB exam, obviously. Um, so again, you don't need to know it as in depth as a pharmacist, but you do need to know enough within your scope of practice to pass the PTCB exam. All right, so listen, that's a basic overview of what you need. I'm pretty sure you have some more questions. Leave it in the comments. I love to get you guys questions and we definitely love to answer them. Me and my team both are looking at your questions and we're waiting to answer them and add more value to you. Also, please, can you subscribe, like, and comment on the video, subscribe to the channel, and I have a special gift for you. If you are looking to master these topics that we talked about and you're looking to pass the PTCB exam, click the link in the description. This is a free masterclass for you. You can attend it. It'll take about one to two hours of your time, but it is jam packed with tons of value. So go take the masterclass, go get some value from it, go get some methods that you can use when you're passing this PTCB exam as far as your studies goes and let us know how it added value to you. So we will talk soon. I so enjoyed delivering this for you. This is Onisha Biggs of Pharmacy Tech Lessons. You have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.